So eventually that number is gonna match that number and it's gonna, we're gonna have zero degrees of superheat. Right now we have barely three. That number is close to saturated temperature. So that's, that's not good because we have a pretty low superheat. So right now the system, what it's trying to do is allowing less liquid to go through. Um, and you can actually saw it firsthand, right? With the TXV, um, low uh, heat load, the TXV will pinch more and maintain that uh, superheat. That's why my pressure dropped. But you see my superheat is still gonna drop regardless of the scenario because I have no heat load. Look at my suction line temperature. It's gonna be the same as my evaporator temperature, my saturated uh, temperature. So, um, and now you can see, you can start to, to see it sweat, but that's my superheater. The difference between the suction line temperature, right? The surface minus the saturated temperature, pressure converted to temperature. But when you have a low heat load, you don't, you can't introduce a lot of heat into that coil, your superheat drops.